What are you doing? What are you doing? Breathe, breathe. anointing. My brother, you want anointing. You are having it. Papa, you are anointed. Fill this for many days. In Jesus' name. Why are you amazed? Why are you amazed? King Yaule Makacha. Let's see. You're free. Be anointed. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Yes, yes you were saying I want this anointing. Yes, Lord. I want this anointing. Yes, ma'am. You have it. Yes. Take the grace. Take the grace. Your road is long. Your road, your road, road, it's long, and it's very bumpy. In other words, it means your road, what you're doing is big, and you have a lot of challenges. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. So now these challenges that you are meeting, it is because of the people that are around you, because some they don't even understand what you are doing, yes. and they don't understand what God has placed in you. Thank now, you, from Jesus. today, when you go back, keep what you are doing to yourself with your God you. and allow God to work through you. Because most of the time, you tell the next person, or I want to do one, two, three, four. Yes. When you go for prayers, you. go to your closet alone. Tell your God. You will see what God will do for you. Thank Let you. me pray for you. In Jesus' name. Do you know what I'm talking about? It's true, ma'am. Okay. You have it. In Jesus' name. In Jesus' name. Uh, my name is Busim Charlie. I'm come from Prakban. Uh, the woman of God prophesied to me that my road is, is long. And that I meet the challenges in that the field that I, I, I in I profess I, I confirm that it's true because I am, I'm in the ministry and then God wants to use me but I facing the lots of challenges because even my husband they don't understand me 
even the people that surrounding us in the church, they don't understand me. So I confirm that is true. How are you feeling right now? I thank God because this is the thing that I want to hear today. I said, God, please allocate me today. So I believe the, my road is going to I walk with Jesus now. And as from now on, as the woman of God said, I, I must be in closet mm -hmm. so that I pray with God. I share everything with God so that God is going to use me mightily. In Jesus name. We give glory to Jesus for your life. I believe that you shall surely come back with the testimony of the fulfillment of the prophecy that the woman of God gave you today in Jesus name. Yes, it's true. I believe it. I will come back soon. Amen. Thank you. Thank you. Amen. Amen. Hey. I'm just hearing anointing anointing. You want anointing? Yes. No, you have it. Already you have it. God cannot call you and don't give you anointing. In Jesus' name. You have it. You have it in Jesus' name. Papa, you have it. Take it. Take it. Take it. Take it. In Jesus' name. Faithful heart. Amen. That's why you are crying for. Amen. That's Always, true, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. I want a faithful heart. Thank you, Jesus. I want to be faithful. Amen. To what Jesus. I am doing. Amen. God has granted you that faithful heart. Amen. And you are going to prosper. In Jesus' name. You are his wife. Okay. Let me pray also for you. You must have a heart like your husband's heart. Yes. Your husband is very humble. Yes. And he's always crying and say, Lord, 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 we need to follow you. Yes. Amen. Also cry the same prayer. Amen. Pray the same prayer. Amen. Cry the same cry. Lord, 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 Jesus. we only need to follow you. Yes. And we will see God doing it for you. It's true. God will make you examples. Yes. Take it in Jesus' name. Ma'am, can you please tell us your name, tell us where you come from, and also introduce the gentleman next to you, and also confirm the prophecy that you received today. My name is Tandiwe. I'm from Pretoria. I'm with my husband. He's also from Pretoria. The prophecy that you received today from the woman of God, is it true or not? It's very true. It's 100% true. I know for a fact that my husband has been praying that God would use him um, in the ministry that he has given him. And also, I want to confirm that this morning, the prayer that Mama spoke about, about faithfulness and humility, that's exactly what I've been praying about this morning. How are you feeling right now? I feel so relieved and so touched because seemingly God hears us when we pray. Amen. Say, so confirm the prophecy that you received today from the woman of God. The prophecy is very true because I even saw Mami praying for me, anointing, anointing me, and I'm happy because I've been praying that, Lord, I want to be faithful. I want you to be known through me. As you died for me on the cross, you were embarrassed for me. I want to live for you, and the prophecy is 120% true. Amen. How are you feeling right now? I'm very ec ecstatic. I'm very excited in Jesus' name. What can you say to other viewers out there? To the viewers out there, especially the young ministers, I just want to encourage them. No matter how the anointing you have, no matter how many gifts or how much gifts you are having, you need to be under a certain man, under certain authority, to submit to certain authority so that you will be having a covering and someone who will be showing you the right way and how to do ministry. What can you say to the viewers out there? I would like to say that the God of Charis is the real Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Mm -hmm. He is an omnipresent God and he is a God that mightily delivers. Amen. Amen. Thank you, sir. Thank you, ma'am. Stay blessed. Thank you. Thank you, ma'am. Thank you. Come, my brother. Are you a pastor? Yeah. Where? Uh, from Zimbabwe. Zimbabwe. Yes, sure. Oh, okay. You are just a pastor or you are a prophet? Pastor, uh, uh, prophet. I, 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 never, I never call myself a prophet. Either. You are a pastor? Yeah. Okay. 
and then now. Why I'm seeing something like a pit before you? Okay. Do you know a pit? Yeah, sure. It's, it's like there is a pit before you. Okay. And you were thinking of how am I going to jump? Yeah, sure. This pit. Am I supposed to go inside? Yeah. Or am I supposed to use a ladder? Yeah, sure. Or to help myself? Yeah, sure. Don't help yourself. Okay. God is going to fight for you. Fine. From today, God will start to feel this pit, this Amen. emptiness you, that you are Amen. seeing before you. Amen. And God will direct you. Thank you, Lord. My name is Sam Marumba. I come from Zimbabwe. And uh, the, 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 the prophets, I, uh, it is uh, it's true. The prophets is true. I was suffering a lot in a... I'm anointed, but uh, not, nothing is moving. But uh, now the, that prophecy is going to bring something. Amen. Yeah. How are you feeling right now? I'm feeling happy because that was uh, I was looking for. Uh, what are the words of encouragement that you can give the viewers out there? Uh, the word of encouragement I give to other people that uh, you have to pers persist mm -hmm. in everything that we do in the Lord. So the Lord will answer you. God wants to use women with a heart like your own. A yes, heart mama. of crying for his people. Yes, mama. It's true. You are always crying for the people of God. It's true. And you always say if they can see what I am seeing and they think the way I'm thinking, yes. things were supposed to be in a better yes. position. God will give you people that will understand Amen. your cry. And they will help you in your crying. In Jesus' name. My name is Mrs. Maureen Tobagale. The man beside me is my husband, Apostle Laibon Tobagale. We are from Jimiste. Confirm the prophecy that you received today from the woman of God, whether it was true or not. I confirm the prophecy to be true. Mm -hmm. Why are you saying it's true? Because I always cry. I had a cry always for women who can cry and work for God, not for possession, but for the kingdom of God. And how are you feeling right now that the woman of God located you today? I'm so blessed that she located me because that was my prayer ever since I got here. Sir, so can you please confirm the prophecy that you received today from the woman of God? Uh, is the prophecy is true because you always praying for people of God and crying the things of God. Um, and how are you feeling today that your wife is uh, uh, connected, uh, uh, located by the Holy Ghost through the woman of God? I believe that as your wife was located, you too you were located in Jesus' name. How are you feeling right now? Today I'm happy because it's the grace of God. I'm so happy. What are the words of encouragement that you can give the viewers out there? As you are servant of God, you decided to come and attend a service with us in Charis Mission Church. What can you say to other servants of God out there? I encourage the men of God who are outside there. We really need the grace. We can really need the grace. What can you say to other women out there? I encourage any other woman that we really need to serve God and we need someone more anointed than us to lay hands upon us. We need a covering. Thank you, sir. Thank you, ma'am. Stay blessed. Thank you. Ma Amen. Amen. I've already spoken to you. It's done. Jesus' name. I'll pray for all of you. Don't worry. In Jesus' name. You are searching for a job? So why are you worrying so much? Don't you know that with God everything is possible? I know. God can never bless others and leave you. He also loves you. Amen. Because sometimes you say, it's like God me, he does not love me. That's true. No, he cannot love me and does not love you. God loves all of us. Yes, Lord. He just wants us to walk in his way. Stop worrying. Thank you. It will come to pass. Amen. In Jesus' name.
Ma'am, can you please tell us your name, tell us where you come from, and also confirm the prophecy that you received today from the woman of God, whether it was true or not. Uh, my name is Mabege Tindan. I come from here uh, in Wini, Tembisa, Wini. Um, the prophecy that gave Mama, uh, that Mama gave me, it's, I confirm it to be 100% true, because I just uh, recently resigned from my, uh, where I was working, and I've been worried to say, okay, I need a job immediately, because I've got expenses that I need to pay before the end of the month. So I confirm Mama's prophecy to be 100% true. How are you feeling? I'm happy. I'm so excited. Yes, I believe that my, I will really get my job before the end of this month. What are the words of encouragement that you can give the viewers out there? Yes, I believe that the Almighty God today has done it for you in Jesus' name. Uh, what I can tell viewers uh, all over the world is that they must keep on holding up on God. So that, um, when you believe in God, you always face challenges. However, when you face challenges, you must always, I mean, you must always believe in God and you must always believe in God's so word. You must always tell God your problems. Don't go around telling people your challenges. Only tell God and then God will use um, his uh, servants to give you his word. Thank you, ma'am. Stay blessed. Thank you. Your ears will hear in Jesus' name. That's what he's crying for. Sir, so can you please tell us your name, tell us where you come from, and also confirm the prophecy that you received today from the woman of God, whether it was true or not. My name is Tingani Lovu. I'm from Vona Valley Midrand. And the woman of God has prophesied to me and said that um, my long is to hear from God at all the times. And I want to confirm the prophecy to be true. And by the grace of God, you were located by the Holy Ghost through the woman of God. How are you feeling? I'm feeling so amazingly great uh, to be located by God and be led by the Holy Spirit. It's what I'm longing for in my life. And as the man of God is not around, did you believe that you were going to be located today? Um, Honestly, this is my first day to be here. I was longing to see the man of God. And I was not sure what's going to happen today because the man of God is not around. But I'm so amazed. I'm so blessed because it, I've learned that it's not about somebody, but it's about God himself. As long as he's in our midst, we're going to have whatever we need to have. What are the words of encouragement that you can give the viewers out there? You said a powerful point that it's not about the pastor that God is using, but it's all about God. What can you say to other viewers out there? As now, the man of God is not around. People, they think that God cannot speak through the woman of God, and today you are located. What can you say to the viewers out there? I will encourage the viewers that they should always have faith in God because faith that what matters. If God sees your heart, it doesn't matter who is around and who is not. God is able to touch anybody, anytime. Amen. We give glory to Jesus for your life. I believe that as you are here, you are free, you are delivered. And as the woman of God declared that you shall hear from God indeed, it shall come to pass and you shall surely give us a testimony in Jesus' name. Amen. Praise the Lord. Amen. Thank you. You're free.